I was in Washington with Christine. Um, there, the church has a temple there on the Belt Lane, and they at, at Christmas time they 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 have jillions of lights on the trees there. So I got invited to come down for the ceremony where they were going to turn this on. And uh, that night we we just stayed near the Reagan Airport. And about two in the morning, I just had this awful pain in my lower back. I just couldn't. So I, um, I tried to all kinds of different positions, and nothing seemed to help. And so about three in the morning, I went down. And, and there was a four, uh, 7-Eleven down the street. Yeah. So I went down and, and, and got a bunch of uh, ibuprofen and took a bunch of those thinking that, you know, it was um, something in my, my uh, muscles were tight. That didn't work. And then I, um, I thought, you know, when I was a high school senior, at, at, at high school, was for my senior year, I had an infection in my kidneys. And I thought, gosh, this thing's exactly like that fell. And uh, so we got in the, came up on the first plane. And I went uh, immediately to a minute clinic, <laughs> thinking that, geez, I'll just give you a little bit of blood and you'll have the test there to determine whether um, in my urine, it wasn't, I'm sorry, it was urine that you checked. Yeah. To see if it, um, if there are bacteria in it. And it turns out in Massachusetts, minute clinics can't run that kind of test. <laughs> so, <laughs> so we had to go to Mass General Hospital, or to uh, Minute, Mount Auburn Hospital, the same place where I took care of my heart attack. Yeah. And, uh, and so they did the analysis, and, and there was nothing wrong in my urine that suggested uh, uh, infection. Yeah. So they sent me to the, the, uh, the emergency, and they uh, were very kindly brought me right in. The, um, the head of the of the emergency is the same guy that or, or, or orchestrated the care of my heart attack. Yeah. And he just started to punch in my side and basically, without telling me, he said, there's something big inside there. And initially he thought that maybe my aorta had blown, blown up. Oh, like an aneurysm. Yeah. So they very quickly did uh, a uh, ultrasound. And Were they going to cut you open and fix the aneurysm? Or? Yeah, so all ready to do that. Yeah. But then the art, because that's, I guess, what it felt like. But then when you could see it, it wasn't that at all. And he then looked around and he said, well, I have good news and bad news. And the, the good news is you don't have an aneurysm. But, yeah. But this, you've got some really big masses in there that feel forever like, uh, like tumors. Yeah. And uh, so he said, I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> We're very kind.